We have seen an overall increase in wealth regulation, as well as a focus on best interest in the last few years. While implementations differ between jurisdictions, the themes are remarkably similar. When dealing with retail clients, wealth managers are expected to act in the best interest of those clients. One aspect of this expectation is Know Your Product, or KYP. With client focus reforms in Canada, both the investment dealer and the advisor have a heightened obligation for KYP. With tens of thousands of products available to the advisor, this becomes a daunting, and I would argue, impossible human task. Evaluating product alternatives from a diverse and growing product shelf, and then comparing those alternatives across a spectrum of cost, risk, and performance requires strong technology support. The record-keeping obligation exponentially increases this data management challenge and calls out for another layer of tech support. While technology will play an increasingly important role in compliance, I think the good news for the advisor and the dealer is that technology will never replace the true value delivered by the advisor. Building client relationships based on human understanding, empathy, and optimism. The client focus reforms are based on a fundamental principle that the client's interests must come first. The regulations codify a set of enhancements to the existing KYC suitability and relationship disclosure requirements. The CFRs also introduce a new Know Your Product or KYP provision for both investment dealers and advisors. For an investment dealer, the KYP expectations move beyond what was previously regulatory guidance to form stringent rules requiring dealers to increase their level of due diligence on the securities made available to their clients. Investment dealers must now take reasonable steps to ensure securities made available to clients have been assessed, approved, and monitored for significant change. When we polled the wealth management industry during our CFR roundtable, we observed that nearly 70% of dealers were exploring how to best monitor significant changes and assess their product shelf. In light of these regulations, our research has shown that a dealer's product shelf is constantly changing. For example, in a typical week, there are over 192 new funds, 21 removed, and 2,000 product changes, which included 1,500 MER changes. Every night, Shelf Monitor reviews industry data to find material changes to the products on your shelf. Keeping track of changes has never been easier. For example, ETF and mutual fund terminations and additions are communicated in an inconsistent format, from press releases to material change reports at unpredictable times. With Shelf Monitor, you can find all relevant additions and deletions in a single place. Shelf Monitor tracks all the changes at the fund series level, so you know exactly what was affected. The changes are presented in a consistent format and available on demand. When there are hundreds of risk rating changes in a single month, instead of looking out for news releases from fund companies, you need a tool to easily identify which products became riskier and which decreased in risk ratings. When there are thousands of product changes, like MERs, to sort through, Shelf Monitor helps you easily identify the funds with the biggest changes. Our goal really is to get you the right information when you need it. While Shelf Monitor reviews many data fields and data sources on a nightly basis, you decide which data points to turn on or off. Our proprietary materiality index then lets you sift through the noise and control which changes rise to the top. You can monitor changes on your shelf using Shelf Monitor's web interface. You can also get significant change alerts sent directly to your inbox. Demonstrating compliance with your significant change monitoring obligation is only a click away. So what do the new KYP provisions require advisors to do? And the best way to consider this new requirement is by contrasting regulatory expectations before and after the client focus reforms. Before the client focus reforms, much of the rep's focus was centered on meeting the suitability requirements. And suitability is fundamentally a matching exercise that asks, 
is the KYC or the client's requirements such as risk tolerance, time horizon, investment objectives, are they aligned with the investments or portfolio characteristics? The client focus reforms go beyond this matching exercise and ask the rep to understand the security she's recommending and the impact of the recommendations fees on the client's portfolio and consider a reasonable range of available alternatives. And in order to make a recommendation that is truly in the client's best interest. And let's not forget that under section 11.5 of CFR, the rep now needs to maintain records on how she met her KYP and suitability requirements. To put this requirement into perspective, let's consider an example that assumes the advisor has approximately 35,000 investment funds available on a firm shelf and needs to make five investment recommendations. To make a compliant recommendation, the advisor needs to assess product characteristics. Let's assume this involves six data points, asset class, product type, fees, risk, performance, and share class. When we do the math, we can see that the advisor needs to process 1 million data points every single day. This clearly is not humanly possible and can only be solved with technology. Given the principle-based nature of the client focus reforms, there's a high degree of ambiguity around the practical application of the advisor's obligations. When we polled the wealth management industry, we observed that nearly 75% had a challenge with the advisor's KYP and assessment of reasonably available alternatives. For example, what is the most effective and compliant manner in which an advisor should meet her KYP obligations, assess a reasonable range of available alternatives, and demonstrate she is accounted for this when recommending investments in the client's best interest. An advisor can confidently meet this regulatory challenge by using InvestorComp's Peer Compare. Peer Compare creates a frictionless experience that empowers the advisor to go beyond a matching exercise and assess how a recommendation stacks up against reasonable range of alternatives based on a configurable peer group and comparison dimensions. So how does an advisor use Peer Compare? Let's join our advisor just after she's determined that a real estate fund recommendation is aligned with the client's needs and circumstances. At this point, she can check off the requirement that her recommendation is aligned with the client's KYC document. Now she needs to assess how the key aspects of her recommendation, namely cost, risk, and return, stacks up against available alternatives. Instead of sifting through a myriad of regulatory documents or conducting a side-by-side -side comparison, Peer Compare generates a peer group which is a subset of similar products available on her shelf. In our real estate fund example, if the advisor's recommended fund doesn't stack up well to its peers, she can change her selection to an alternative real estate fund that stacks up better among other suitable options. Peer Compare completes the advisor's workflow by integrating with the record keeping engine. The advisor's recommendation, analysis of available alternatives, and accompanying advisor notes are tracked all centrally in our application. The solution also delivers and tracks all related disclosure documents to your investor. And all activities can be reported and tracked at the advisor, branch, or enterprise level. Every firm has unique compliance challenges and is approaching the KYP and suitability dilemma slightly differently. So why do firms value InvestorCom solutions? We hear three common themes. Our solutions are very intuitive, which means strong adoption with financial advisors. We have a single platform for KYP best interest analysis and record keeping. And perhaps most importantly, ease of implementation and integration. Please contact us today for a conversation on how we can provide you with compliance pain relief.